I'm Nihal, and this is Veterans on Radio One Stories. British troops spend six months on either summer or winter tours in Afghanistan. It's a long time for them to be away from their family and loved ones. A lot of friends who've got families, kids, it does hurt them a lot and they can't go home at Christmas. Or if they miss a birthday, especially when kids are very young. There's a lot happening from speaking to walking to everything you they do. It does destroy them a bit when the partner's on the phone saying your child's talking, walking and all that sort of stuff. It does hurt them because they haven't seen it. Girlfriends, obviously a few friends end up splitting up while they're out there. Like I had a girlfriend in 2007, 2008. It was very hard for me then just to speak to her, just to communicate really. You get a sat phone, you get so many minutes a week you can call them. But he's getting the right signal. <laughs> it's quite hard to get a signal of where we were. You were kind of like walking around, phone in the air. When you do get through, it's, it's quite good to speak to someone, just to hear their voice. And every time I was on the phone, all I wanted to do was just listen to what they had to say rather than hear me talk. It was just good to hear them talk about anything, just their daily routine or whatever. Having done it once, Luke Wilson knew exactly what to expect on his second tour. But he didn't want to think too much about the risks. The casualty rate seemed to have got higher. And obviously I was thinking, second time round now, you know, it seems to be a bit more dangerous. Anyway.